हेलो फ्रेंड्स हैप्पी मॉर्निंग माय सेल्फ मीनल भगत फ्रॉम एकिन द ब्रांड ऑफ इंडिया फ्रॉम द पास्ट फ्यू डेज आई हैव बीन रिसीविंग अ लॉट ऑफ क्वेरीज एंड क्वेश्चंस रिगार्डिंग व्हाट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन एन इंटरैक्टिव फ्लैट पैनल एंड एन इंटरैक्टिव वाइट बोर्ड व्हाई अ लॉन्ग थ्रू एंड व्हाई नॉट अ शॉर्ट थ्रू और व्हाई अ शॉर्ट थ्रू एंड व्हाई नॉट अ लॉन्ग थ्रू द वीजीए एंड एचडीएमआई केबल्स क्वालिटी इज रियली पैथेटिक दे आर गिविंग अ लॉट ऑफ चैलेंजेस टू अस और दे आर आस्किंग व्हाट आर द कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ अ क्लासरूम so finally i decided let me address this you know to all these queries with this video so first let me just walk you through the kind of classrooms we are talking about one the first classroom we are talking about is a basic classroom second we are going to talk about a standard classroom and third we are going to talk about the advanced classroom so basic classroom as you can see having a few components what are the components one an interactive whiteboard two a shot through projector with a wall mounting kit three a pc and fourth a speaker now when i talk about the long through and the shot through projector and the ultra shot through what is the difference So when you size the classroom let us assume the size of the classroom is around say 400 square feet and the number of students are roughly 30 to 40 the teacher who is teaching you have these students sitting till the end the long through projector means it is from the board around 8 feet with a ceiling mount kit and the short through projector means from the board around 2 to 3 feet with attached to the wall and ultra short through means you are absolutely on the above the board now why when you talk about a long through and the short through the difference is the shadow the shadow in the long through is big in the short through it is shorter and in ultra short through there is no shadow so that is how you size a projector now when you talk about the price of this whole component then keeping in mind it's an entry level you know module with an entry level pc the tentative cost would be around roughly 70000 second moving towards the standard classroom when we talk about the standard classroom let me just walk you through the standard classroom the components remaining the same few of them interactive whiteboard one shot through projector the wall mounting kit the pc the speaker all should be now coming into the digital teaching device now as you can see over here this is called a digital teaching device this device has is also called all in one now why all in one you can see this is a controller which is being kept here now what is the advantage of this it has got a power button if i am a teacher i have to come into the classroom and if i have to keep juggling with all the plugs putting here and there so see i my main focus is on teaching and if i have to handle these pcs and all those things i get very disturbed so to alleviate this problem eliminate this problem we decided to bring this kind of a device now what does a teacher do like just like when he is coming into the classroom and he is switching on the light and the fan same way if he switch on this power button the board the projector gets on second if he switch on there if he wants to increase the sound of the speaker he can increase or decrease the sound of the speaker if he wants to connect a controller he can just switch it on like this put the book content over here and have to have the you know controller book uh, book content coming on the board same way in case let me tell you what is it inside this how is it working inside now if i open this you can see there's a pc inside there is a speaker inside there a lot of components which get converged into a controller which is helping at the ease of use and you can put it in a lock and key beneath i have put that visualizer and these are the you know boxes where i am putting my accessories so i can see you can see i can have my stylus over here i can have my remotes being put here i can put everything here with a keyboard and a mouse also being here and if i now lock this this becomes secure and safe so when i talk about a digital teaching device it is a compact all in one with all the accessories putting inside this now if i talk to you about a budget of this kind of a classroom 
wherein we are talking about these accessories the tentative budget would be 125000 now the best part is with the basic and the standard the complete components including the hdmi and the vga cables all are being provided by ekin moving forward let me now take you to the advanced kind of a smart classroom now let us talk about the advanced classrooms when we talk about the advanced smart classrooms we can you can, as you all can see we have an interactive flat panel behind me now what is what do you mean by interactive flat panel so earlier when i had talked about an interactive whiteboard we needed a projector to display now in this interactive flat panel you do not need a projector for display the projector gets inbuilt inside it this looks more or less like a tv now with this there is an inbuilt pc also which is available now when i talk about the inbuilt pc as you all can see here it is put behind this you know the panel now this panel is a 65 inch panel with an led sensor all throughout which is making this interactive it is mounted on a wall mount kit with an inbuilt pc inside it so when you have an inbuilt pc inside it i can switch from android to windows both simultaneously so as a teacher if i have to work in android i can do that and so i can work on a windows in case i want to work on a ppt and i would like to also go into the animations i can do that through windows and in case i want to work on android by you know you know teaching and writing on a continuous slides i can do that so all the features are getting available for the best of the use for the teacher besides it is with a 4k resolution now we have got another option in this many a times people are looking for ke i can i connect my laptop with this panel yes of course you can do that what happens you need not put an ops you can put a pc or a laptop which can be attached to this panel now if i put a pc or a laptop attached to this panel all i need to do is just plug and play with the hdmi and usb and of course my laptop gets on i can also put a mini pc as you can see it is over here this mini pc also can be used to get attached to the panel so if i have a pen drive i can insert the pen drive on the mini pc as well as on the panel so i have got multiple options to work on so finally when we talk about the complete set of this advanced classroom the tentative budget would be roughly around 225000 keeping in mind the pc also here when we talk about the pc we talk about a tentatively i5 with 7 generation pc once again i would like to tell you and share this it is only ekin brand which has a complete solution under one umbrella all you need to do is subscribe to ekin youtube channel once again thanking you myself meenal bhagat